Welcome to Sultana football. A little drive down the I-15. We're in Barstow, and the Sultans kick off to start the game. Kind of a weak-looking field here at Barstow. The Aztecs running it back up inside the 35 to almost the 38-yard line, and that's where they'll spot it first and 10 for Barstow. No Sultana, a non-league game tonight. One home game remaining next week against Apple Valley. That's going to be a big one, and here comes the Aztecs at quarterback Travis Hunter. Hands off and little or no gain as Sultana defense all over that one. Second and eight, they gave them two on that play. Ball out just outside the 39-yard line. As I said, we're in Barstow tonight, the Sultans are. And here's an inside handoff. Nope, a fake. And they run it off to the left side. And again, Sultana all over that play. So, so far, Barstow, two running plays to start the game. Unable to make too much of a dent in the Sultana offense. Here's Hunter under center. And again, that handoff off the left side and carrying the ball, Rayshon Hines. And nowhere, and it's going to force a punt. Fourth and five. Barstow comes up like they're going to go for it. They're on their own 43-yard line. Hunter, and they are going to go for it. And now he calls a timeout. So the Aztecs set up like they were going to try for that on fourth and five. Uh, perhaps they were trying to get the Sultans to jump offside. Didn't work. So now they go into punting formation, and Sultana will get the ball for the first time this evening. Ten minutes to go in the first quarter. Nothing to nothing. Sultana on the road tonight in Barstow. And here's the kick. And it's going to be caught at about the 22-yard line. Fair cut you on the play. And Sultana will take over. Looks like they're going to move it out to maybe the 23 or 24-yard line. Flag on the play, though. It was a dead ball. Personal foul, oh, against Sultana. And again, Sultana has had a big problem with penalties all season long. And right away tonight, they start off with a penalty that pushes them even further back into their own territory. So the ball's on the 12-yard line, first and 10. Bryce Lynch at quarterback. Of course, Danny Ferrato is gone for the season now with a broken collarbone. Justin Pele got the handoff there, but there's another flag on the play. And here's the call. It was offside against the Aztecs. So a little break for Sultana there, and they'll have the ball out to the 17-yard line, and it will be first and five. As I said, Danny Ferrato is now out for the season with a broken collarbone. So Ellers and Pele will be carrying the load at running back now for the last two games of the season. Here's Lynch up under center. Look at Zach Sweeney. He's in there with Ellers. Pele the deep back. And here he goes. Justin Pele cuts back to the inside, trying to make something happen. Goes over the right side. 30, 35. Tries to cut back to the 40. He got there. 41, 42, 43. Justin Pele with a nice run. A couple of nifty moves to make Aztec tacklers miss. And they spot that ball at the 44-yard line easily. A first down for the Sultan. So Sultana on the move early here. Lynch now. And the handoff this time. Inside going to get about a yard on that play before it's stuffed by the Aztec defense. Second and nine at the 45-yard line now. Nothing to nothing your score early in the first quarter. Here's Lynch up under center. Two blocking backs and a deep back, and he hands off to the back. And very little yardage that time. Maybe a yard or two. And they do give them just that yard at the 46-yard line. It will be third and eight for Sultana. Again, that same formation with the two blocking backs and a deep back. And Lynch hands off to the second back. Here goes James Ellers. And he has got a big gain at the 30, at the 25-20. He's going to take it all away. James Ellers, touchdown, Sultana. So Ellers with a big run off the left side. Takes it all the way, 54 yards for a touchdown. Here's Cunningham for the extra point. And Sultana is going to take the early lead. Cunningham's point, a little bit of a line drive, but it's good enough. Seven to nothing. Four minutes gone in the first quarter. So James Ellers with a big run off the left side. He pounds it into the end zone, and Sultana with the lead. Here's Cunningham's kickoff now. 
That's a short kick taken at the 15 to the 20. To the 25, coming out to the 30-yard line on the return. Marvin Cornish for the Aztecs. And they're going to spot that ball at the 29-yard line. First and 10, Barstow. On league game for both teams. They'll both finish up with league games next week. Victor Valley will be playing Barstow in the Axe game. And here's a completion for the Aztecs. And that's thrown out to Rayshon Hines. And he takes it across the 40-yard line. The Sultana will finish next week against Apple Valley. They are playing Rim of the World tonight in a battle of undefeated teams. Here's Travis Hunter. And he fakes the handoff. He's going to drop back and throw incomplete. He intended that for Rayshon Hines. Second and 10 now. Ball at the 43-yard line. Sultana with a 7-0 lead. Thanks to a touchdown run by James Ellers. Here's Hunter. And this time he hands off to the right side. On the carry, that's Mike McRae. Driven out of bounds. He's short of the first down, third and three. Marstow at midfield. Trying to take it into Sultana territory for the first time this evening. Here's Hunter. And the handoff, and it looks like he's going to be close to the first down. On the carry, once again, Mike McCray. It was enough for a first down. First and 10 at the Sultana 46-yard line. Hunter brings them up. And now he's going to throw. Drops back. Has a man open, wide open, but it's fumbled. And it's going to be ruled incomplete. That was Tiolo Topi. And now they rule it was complete. Looked like it hit the ground there, but it didn't. And it's first and 10 at the 24-yard line. So Barstow knocking on the door, down 7 to nothing, Looking to tie this thing up. And here goes Hunter rolling to his right. And he loses the ball. We'll wait for the call. It was a fumble. Second down, it's Barstow. 